In this video, I will be comparing the AMD Ryzen 7 5700G and AMD Ryzen 7 5700X, highlighting their differences, and then presenting a conclusion to assist you in determining the superior choice. Both processors are formidable offerings from AMD's Zen 3 architecture, each possessing its own strengths and weaknesses. Let's delve into them. The Ryzen 5700X was released approximately 11 months after the release of the Ryzen 5700G. Both processors feature 8 performance cores and 16 performance threads. This increased count enables the processors to handle multiple tasks simultaneously and efficiently. The base clock frequency of the Ryzen 5700X is 3.4 GHz, while that of the Ryzen 5700G is 3.8 GHz. With the higher frequency of the Ryzen 5700G, it proves advantageous when the CPU is under normal loads. The boost clock frequency for both processors is 4.6 GHz. The L1 and L2 cache for both of these processors are 64 KB and 512 KB, respectively. However, the L3 cache of the Ryzen 7 5700X is 32 MB shared, whereas that of the Ryzen 5700G is 16 MB. With the larger cache size of the Ryzen 7 5700X, it gains an advantage in scenarios where data access patterns favor smaller, faster caches, such as in some single-threaded games. Both processors support up to 128GB of DDR4 RAM with a maximum frequency of 3200MHz. The Ryzen 5700G features integrated graphics with a boost frequency of 2000MHz, while the Ryzen 5700X does not have integrated graphics. Consequently, for graphical tasks, the Ryzen 5700G performs better. Here we are not taking dedicated graphics into consideration. The Ryzen 5700X supports ECC, whereas the Ryzen 5700G does not. Therefore, for critical systems, the Ryzen 5700X is preferable. The Ryzen 5700X supports PCI version 4, whereas the Ryzen 5700G only supports PCI version 3. Both processors support 24 PCI lanes. Having a higher number of PCI lanes enables the handling of massive data transfers with low latency, benefiting network cards and high-end graphics cards. The Ryzen 5700X can operate at temperatures up to 90 degrees Celsius, while the Ryzen 5700G can reach temperatures of up to 95 degrees Celsius. The TDP of the Ryzen 7 5700G is configurable and ranges from 45 to 65 watts, whereas the Ryzen 7 5700X has a fixed TDP of 65 watts. The 65W TDP of the Ryzen 5700X applies solely to the CPU, without any throttling due to integrated graphics. This ensures more consistent performance under heavy CPU loads compared to the 5700G. If we compare prices, the Ryzen 5700X is slightly more expensive than the Ryzen 5700G. Now, let's examine benchmark comparisons. According to Cinebench R23 and Geekbench V6, both in single-core and multi-core scenarios, the Ryzen 5700X appears to outperform the Ryzen 5700G. My suggestions are as follows. Choose the Ryzen 7 5700G if you need a CPU with integrated graphics for basic gaming and multimedia, and you are on a tight budget. Choose the Ryzen 7 5700X if you need the best possible CPU performance for demanding workloads, and you already have a dedicated graphics card. This much for today. If you like this video please like share and subscribe to the channel. Also click on bell icon to never miss any update.